you so much for stopping by my channel and choosing to watch this video. I'm Tamar and I hope you enjoy this presentation. If you do, don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Also feel free to leave me a comment. Thank you so much for joining me on this walkthrough presentation of my new tutorial. And this is With Desire, a new collection by Stamperia, and the designer is Dorota Kotovic. I hope you enjoyed the walkthrough, and a link to the tutorial is posted in the description below. Okay, so this album is 10 and a half by 8 and a half inches. The pages themselves are eight by 10, and the spine is three and a half inches. The cover is mixed media, and you'll have in the tutorial a video of the process, and it is not narrated. You can just watch me do it, but if you're not into mixed media art, you can always just use the paper and do your own cover. Okay. okay, so on the spine, I just added some uh, ribbons and a little bit of a filigree medallion here. And the back side of it is just plain and there's really nothing on it. It's just uh, one of the pages, papers that attach to it. Okay, so let's dive in. The cover is with uh, some molds here as you can see it is in 3d so there are it, it's a canvas um, i use chipboard as my substrate for the canvas painted i used some molds and again in the supply list you have uh, the list of all of the products that i used You'll have to go uh, follow the link to my website, download the cut list, and you'll have the entire supply list over there. Okay. There's also some die cuts, some uh, graphic 45 paper flowers, some sparkles, um, and that's basically it. And just a very nice composition. Let's open up okay so this is for the cover for the inside cover the front page and the back it are the same and you have a pocket here another pocket here and a flap and this is the flap I have a card here that I can show you where you insert things. So some pockets are short and some are long. So I like to do double pockets sometimes where you can put a photograph here and then just tuck something there and write something about the photograph. Okay, And then you close this like that and tuck it in. Okay, so page one, you open the ribbon. You have a little belt here with two flaps. One flap goes to the right and one to the left. And over here you have space. You can, again, put a couple of photographs there. And this whole thing flaps up. And this area here, this flap, try to show you okay so there's a pocket here and then there's another tuck pocket but this one is upside down but it's good enough for you to tuck something in there and then over here you have a side flap it's a side waterfall 
with an area here that you can write something. Let me put it down again. So you can write something here and then you can write something there and put a photographs here in the back. So you'll have several of these. And you can, you have the space where you can put something here as well. And as it closes with a ribbon, and it keeps everything nice and tight right there. Okay. In between two sections, there is a pocket where you can have a photo mat to put things here with a little tag that you can pull it out easily. I think I put it the right place. Okay, so this is the second section, and I have a right flap here that in the tutorial video, it started with something else, and then uh, I jumped over and corrected it and changed the front. So I'm just letting you know right now that as you start the second tutorial of this section, this will be different. Okay, over here, there's a room here for photographs and there's a chipboard there. And here we have uh, in the back of the flap, another pocket. You can tuck something here and put a photo here. And this is a flap that the whole thing now, when it closed, the whole thing will just go up like so. Okay, I'll try to pull it up. So you can see the back of it, there's a flap, and then it flaps again. So you have room here for photograph. And here there's actually a mat that goes inside the belly band. So you can put a photograph here and then tuck it inside the belly band and it will hide the photo. And I think this is a very cool feature. All right, on the bottom part here, again, you have a deep pocket, and this is a nice place for a large photograph right there. And as you open it up, there's room here to put something, and then there's another pocket right there, and I already have something tucked in there. And again, this whole thing flaps down that was a little glitch. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay, so you have uh, something here to apply a photo here. And as you open this up, you have a double pocket here in a triangle. You have one here and one there. So you actually have two pockets. Okay. The third section, again, you open it up with a ribbon and you have a belt that opens top and bottom with room here for two photographs on the bottom and two photographs here on the top. Over here on the bottom, there are two flat pockets that you can tuck something here and here. And this flaps to the left. It flaps to the right. It flaps to the left again. And the whole thing flaps to the right again. And as you flap it again to the right, over here on the back, you have room for a long photograph. Over here, you have a small photo mat inside the pocket. And here you have a pocket with two photo mats that you can put a photograph here and tuck a writing in the back. And as you put them in here, it keeps the waterfall closed. So this waterfall, we have six of them. It's six flaps. 
that you can put a photo here on the top or you can just leave it like that. And as you flap them out at the back, you have room here for a photo as well. Same as before, you have room here for a photo mat that fits right in between the two pages. And it's quite large. It'll fit nicely, a large photo, or a few smaller ones. And you also have a tab here, so it's easy to hold it and pull it out. Okay, the next section. So over here, okay, again, I have a, a photo mat that, tucked, that is tucked right here where the uh, belly button is right there. And over here in this page, I have a flap with room for fo two photographs. One here and one here. And here I have a pocket. Here I have a long pocket. And this can fit, you know, something really big in here. So this whole thing is a pocket. And I have a smaller one here. The next section, I have a belt here with a little buckle. Opens to the right and to the left. And there's a flat pocket there. Very nice for tucking things. And again, a long pocket there. So you have a big pocket here. And again, a big pocket here. And this will be really nice to hold quite a few photographs in there. As you open it up, you have a double page that is symmetrical with two flaps, one on the right and one on the left, that will hold a photograph here and here. And again, there is a pocket here and a pocket here. And I think that's it for this section. And a third large photo mat that fits in the pocket here between the two pages. And our last page has a belt again. And with a nice buckle, it opens to the right and to the left. Over here, again, I have a pocket place here for writing. And I'll pull it down. And over here, okay, there's a flap that goes all the way to the top. So you can put something here. And then there's a smaller flap that goes up with room for photos. Over here, I have a pocket. Let's see, where's my pocket? Here's my pocket right there. And another smaller pocket right there. So again, it's really nice. You just tuck a photo here and the writing here. You can journal something on the back that explain what the photo is about. And as you open it, this page, same thing. There's a large pocket there. Put something here. And as you open this to the left, you have three sections here that are identical. Okay. 
So they each have a flap that you can put photographs here. One, two, and three. And then they have all these flap up. And as you flap up, there is room here for photographs, room here, and a pocket right there. So you have those three pockets here. to take this out as the belt is the last thing that closes and keep everything closed okay. and this is the back identical to the front we have a flap here and a double pocket here and here and that's it that is our album I really hope that you like it and if you look at the description you'll find a link to where you can download the cut list it is not going to cost you anything this is uh, courtesy of creative treasures but you know you can go in register and download it for free there are I think seven videos or eight videos in the series each section has a separate video and then i have a, the a, two videos for the cover one that will show you how to make the cover and the second one will show you how to make the front um, canvas here there is another video that i suggest for you to watch that explain how to approach my tutorials and uh, the cover, you know, because if you watched my videos before, it's the same thing. It's repetitive. There was no reason to narrate it again. Uh, if you have never done a cover before, please look for uh, one of my other videos that will teach you how to make the cover. If you're not sure where it is, um, I'm happy to direct you to it. And any questions, I'm always happy to answer. So again, I thank you very much for stopping by and watching my tutorial, watching the walkthrough, even if you don't do the tutorial. And um, I will catch you on the next video. Bye.